Welcome to Cruise News for September 8, 2020. Royal Caribbean's new Wonder of the Seas was floated out from the French shipyard where it is being built over the weekend. Well, it wasn't built in one weekend, but it was floated out over the weekend. The Wonder is the fifth, fifth Oasis-class vessel and should be the largest cruise ship in the world when it is finished. Due to delays at the shipyard, it is going to be pushed back until 2022. If you are a fan of the Oasis-class ships, this looks to be an awesome addition, and we are glad to see progress still being made. Princess Cruises has announced they will have five cruise ships serving the Australian market for the 2021 to 2022 season. These include the Coral Princess, Royal Princess, Emerald Princess, Sapphire Princess, and Pacific Princess, all sailing from Melbourne and Sydney. We know it's over a year out, but never too early to plan your dream Oceana voyage. Costa Cruises has a bit of good news and bad news today. First, the good news. The Costa Deliciosa, which I'm sure I'm still not saying right, set sail on Sunday from Italy in Costa's first cruise since they had shut down. We wish the journey happy sailings. On the Costa not-so-great news, Costa announced they have canceled all South America sailings from November 2020 through April 2021. After a few successful sailings on TUI's Mindshift lines, cruise ship reviews and onboard vlogs are starting to come out. Morgan at Very Unofficial Travel Guides has been posting his daily videos now that he is back, and they are well worth a view. Link will be in the description below. Norwegian Cruise Line had promised an update by the end of August with any changes on their service suspension or resumption dates. So far, no word is out, but we expect an update any moment. The rumor so far is voyage cancellations will be extended through the end of 2020. Fingers crossed that stays a rumor. Time for today's cruise trivia. Royal Caribbean has a loyalty program called Crown and Acre. What is the top status you can earn in their program? Remember to hit that like button and comment below with any questions you might have. It really does help the YouTube algorithm get our channel in front of more people and will help us to get our goal of 1,000 subscribers. If any of the videos being recommended on the screen look interesting, please take a click on explore. Hope everyone has a great day.